do you find translating ancient Greek easier than doing translation from protein synthesis? Well, don't worry, I'm here to help. My name's Mr. White and I've got more than 20 years experience of teaching biology. So translation occurs at the ribosome and what happens is a long strand of our mature transcript of mRNA enters the ribosome and is read in these little triplets of bases called codons all the way along the mRNA. Now the first codon is called the start codon, that signals to the ribosome to start translation. And the last codon is called the stop codon, which signals to stop translation. Now each codon has a corresponding anticodon, which is attached to the tRNA molecule, which also carries a specific amino acid. Now when the anticodon is complementary to the codon, the tRNA brings in a specific amino acid, which then joins this long chain called a polypeptide, where the amino acids are joined by peptide bonds. After the tRNA has delivered its specific amino acid, it then leaves the ribosome. Hope that helped. Follow me for more.